Hey guys, what's up? It's Matt from Mechabyte.com, and a couple of you tech-savvy users will know that Spotify just launched for America today. So there's been a lot of controversy with it, um, getting the record labels to go ahead and agree, because basically what Spotify does is to go ahead and pay them, and it allows you to listen to pretty much any song that uh, they have permission to stream from anywhere you're connected to the internet. So right now it is in public beta, like you saw, um, and there is a way you can get in without a bit, without an invite, and uh, I'll go ahead and show you guys how to do that later, but um, props to Appleman5487 who went ahead and told me how to do that today. Um, but really quick, I'm just gonna go ahead and give you a quick demo. So here I am, I am an American, and I am using Spotify. So really quick, um, when you open this app, you'll notice that it does have a resemblance to iTunes, but uh, it also does look a little bit better in my opinion because I do like the dark interface a little bit more. Um, what's new? That's kind of like the newest songs that you can listen to. And I'll just give you a quick run through. Um, here's some songs. They do have advertisements, but that helps to pay for uh, the streaming rights. And here's feed. The feed and basically what it is here, you can choose people to like follow and it'll like go ahead and show your friends and stuff. And uh, I actually did connect it to Facebook, although you can't see that right now. Um, but you can add tracks to a play queue, kind of like playlists on the go for the iPod. And uh, devices, you can go ahead and hook up your iPod and sync it from here. Um, library, basically, just like Google Music, um, it'll go ahead and sync all the stuff from your computer. So you see most of my iTunes library is on here. And you can go ahead and play this from anywhere. So local files, you can star play, you can star uh, tracks. Um, but really quick, I'm just gonna go ahead and play something that's not copyrighted. So there we go. What's up, my nuggets, so Fank Mr. Fan? Pretty good podcast. Um, basically, how this works is that when you sign up, if you choose not to pay, you go ahead and you get a free account, um, obviously. But basically, what that allows you to do is you can go ahead and stream 20 hours of music for free. So this is any music you want. You um, Like I showed you, they have a lot of music that they have indexed already. You can view the top songs. You see they have uh, some popular ones on iTunes. And you can listen to all these for free. So I do know that you can make multiple accounts if you really want to get into that. But you also have an option for your profile over here. And uh, can I? Yeah. On your profile, you can go ahead and actually opt in to show your the artists that you play the most, the tracks that you play the most, your favorite stuff. And uh, what you can do is you can go ahead and add friends, like I said, on Facebook. So pretty cool functionality. And you can also upgrade your account. But I'm not going to do that right now because I'm a freeloader. So I'm going to go back over there. Really, this is just a really cool app. Um, it's an alternative to uh, Google Music. It's pretty much the same stuff because right now they have a lot of tracks that you can listen to for free as well. But um, if you want to figure out how you can actually go ahead and get Spotify right now without a beta invite, I'll have a link in the description and hopefully it'll, um, the article, I'll go ahead and write it right now. It'll Hopefully it'll be up by the time the video is uploaded. Uh, if not, just cut going, check back later. It should be the first link in the description. Um, but that's it guys. Thanks for watching and I will see you later.